What I'm doing this morning is big stitch quilting, and you do that with a larger than average thread. It's this 12 pearl cotton, or you can use number eight, either one. And I've marked some lines that I'm following here. They're very faint. And when you sharpen a chalk pencil, you really need to do it with a sharpener that only makes a point like that. Otherwise, if it's too long, it'll break when I'm doing it. I set that to one side. This is an embroidery needle, and it has a longer than average oval eye. So the pearl cotton is threaded in that. I'm not putting this in a hoop. I'm here demonstrating today, and a hoop is just too much equipment. But I did baste it, so I'm just gonna get my hands up underneath it and sort of crunch it together. And I'm laying the flat of this finger underneath where the stitching's gonna happen. And the needle is held more or less in a perpendicular fashion, and then I kind of bend it back, and that makes a gap. It goes down, you estimate the size of the stitch, and gap, stitch, and gap. You manipulate it quite a bit between your right and your left hand. Push the needle through, and it takes three stitches at a time. You can always smooth it out as you go. So, big stitch quilting, I think, it's great for modern looking quilts, or this is kind of a, 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 let me see, a combination. Traditional crazy patch blocks, but a modern aesthetic with sashing and wide borders on that. And I chose a contrasting color thread. That's something about big stitch quilting. If I'm gonna take hand stitching, I want it to show. So I chose this bright, fiery red. So, big stitch, both modern quilters and traditional quilters enjoy it. The tools for big stitch quilting are very easy. You use a number 12 or number 8 pearl. This is by Presencia. To mark my quilting lines, I use a white chalk pencil by Roxanne. The one thing about a chalk pencil is to make sure that the point is what's called a short comb. So this pencil sharpener by Colonial is great for that it gets exactly the right shape that I want to do it. So minimal tools for great effect.